Based on statistics, Kimberly Schwartz is the kind of student who might find it tougher to get hired in Silicon Valley. She's got the right qualifications, student at one of the world's top universities, Berkeley, and internships at both Facebook and Apple. But she's part Latina, part Chinese, a woman, and undocumented. There's like a huge lack of diversity, and um, we don't really see Latinos. Like the Latinos that you see are the ones working like in the kitchen or like um, cleaning in the, in the cleaning services. And so it's very important to see somebody like yourself being very successful. Someone like Kimberly's mentor, tech entrepreneur Laura Gomez. When we say the modern workforce, we include women, we include a much more diverse millennial population. Gomez founded Atipica to help recruiters hire more people based on merit. Atipica's technology uses artificial intelligence to detect bias in the hiring process. For Gomez, this is personal as well as professional. She grew up undocumented too, and so did her product manager, Ruby Sanchez, who only found out she was undocumented after becoming a finalist for a Gates Foundation Millennium Scholarship and didn't have the documentation to show she qualified. Sanchez went on to found her own medical tech startup. She's excited about Atipica's potential. The more and more that I talked to Laura and she gave me all this data, I realized like right now tech is not merit-based. Um, there's a lot of bias. And so to be able to help with that, I think it's really amazing. Atipica's data scientist says from the very start, they discovered huge disparities in terms of gender and ethnicity on who was applying for a job at tech companies and who was actually being hired. They say the key reason is implicit bias from company processes and their hiring managers. Now diversity is, is going to be an important thing for me no matter what going forward, right? Um, and I think working here is the reason that that was brought out. Um, I never particularly thought about the issue as much before I came here. And I'm only one person, but, you know, at the very least, no matter what happens here, you know, I hope that Lara always knows that she made this impact on me and in my life. Atipica is already changing the world around here and to its own benefit. The company recently raised $2 million, believed to be the largest round of seed funding ever for a Latina-run tech startup. Mark New, CGTN, San Mateo, California.